Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a what's in my camera bag video. There's not really much in my bag, but I figured I would do this video so I can do it over time to see what changes. If you can hear some sounds in the background, there is a carnival going on like a few blocks away. So obviously the first thing I have in my camera bag is my camera, which is the A6400 Sony camera. I'm filming on, on it right now so it's not going to be in my bag. And also I have the mic that is also not in my bag but I will include pictures so you can see what they look like. On that camera I have my lanyard, not lanyard, my camera strap. I will also include pictures of that. I got it from Amazon. I looked for a while for something that was colorful and like different, like more unique than the black one that it came with that said Sony on it. And on it I also have these two things that you can put on the edge of the straps so you can make it easy to take off the strap of the camera which comes in handy if you want to film or take a picture and the strap is getting in the way. You just literally clip the camera strap off and it takes a few seconds versus having to go through like physically doing it where you have to do the fabric through the loops and get it off which takes probably a few minutes versus you can use these clips take it off in a few seconds so that is something that I got that is definitely worth it because sometimes the strap can get in a way and it could ruin a picture or a video that if you waited two minutes to take the strap off manually it would be done the moment would be over so it definitely helps out there this is my camera bag I got this from Amazon I think it was about $20 came in different colors it has the zippers here it's supposed to be waterproof but I haven't tested that out it has this strap and it has these clips here so I actually clipped on this other bag this is what I originally got for my camera, but then I realized it wasn't big enough to include my accessories, so that's why I got the other bag. This one is black, it's hard-sided, and it opens. Right now I just have this, like, this you can use to get, like, sand out of your camera. I don't know what it's technically called. I don't know. My mom said that it was something that you'd use to get the snot out of a baby's nose, but I use it to get, like, dust out of hard spots in the camera. In this container, I also have the boom mic i also have it in here they both fit this and then the mic i put in this section now if i know i'm not going to be filming video and i'm not going to need the mic or that little the <laughs> little squishy thing then i could detach this easily from my strap so i don't have it to carry it now we're moving on to this thing so you open it up and you have to unzip it again but in the front first it has this pocket and in here let's see i have this it's a lens wipe in here and just like a thing to clean the lens with the, the cloth just in case I need it. I do have a mask. This one is used so I will be throwing this out. <laughs> and I have extra lens wipes that you can just use on the camera. You need to make sure that you can use them on the camera because some of them have too high like alcohol content for that. But this one says use it on a camera on the back. This also came with it. This is something that's Velcro and you can put it in the bigger compartment of this bag to like separate stuff but I just think it gets in the way. So I put it in the front pouch in case I need it. Now this is the big compartment of it. You can see a lot of like bubble wrap. I keep an extra lens. This is a lens from an old film camera and I just got an adapter so I can use it on my Sony camera. I have this automatic lens that came with the camera that is 16 to 50 but this one I like is manual and sometimes if I want to do something that's a little more slower paced then I like to use this one but for video I tend to use the automatic. Then I have an extra battery obviously because mirrorless cameras tend to um, go through batteries quickly so I always keep an extra battery. I try to keep it charged but I do notice that if you don't use the battery, it does lose charge over time, even if it's just sitting. Then I have the charger, which obviously sometimes I might take this stuff out if I know I'm not going to be needing it. If I know I'm not going to have some place to charge it, I will take this out of my bag. This is just a wall charger that did not come with my camera. I had to buy it separately, but it makes it a lot easier to have it all compact in one thing. So I usually have my camera in the bottom next to the lens. My camera fits in this section and then on top of my camera I put my battery and the charger on top. So that is everything I have in my camera bag. It's not very extensive. I don't do camera stuff professionally obviously. I do it for fun and I didn't want a bag that's too heavy or cumbersome because then I know I won't use it. Even this sometimes I'm like I'm not going to bring it because it's too big. I usually take this thing off when I go 
go places because it adds bulk to it but it gets the job done and if i know specifically what i'm going to be needing i try to use the bring the least stuff possible so, i mean every time you bring stuff somewhere it's possible that it could get damaged so i try to bring the least amount of equipment possible and be concerned about what i need and just bringing that so thanks for watching i've been trying to upload different things on my channels and just focusing on what i enjoy and doing that and not thinking about the algorithm or whatever so thanks for watching if you like this video please please subscribe and give a thumbs up and leave it in the comments below um, anything I should add to my bag or any upgrades that you think would be helpful. See you next time. Bye.